and it's done. <laughs> my campaign website in which you can see all of my manifesto points, www.lawrencefox.com. I actually can't see anything about my glasses on. Yes. Hi. It's time for the important part of the campaign, which is to release policies that could hopefully take London to the max. Lots to get through today, quite a few bits and a few bobs. The reason why you're going to want to stick around is because of the following. Street Smart is back, in a way. Every single cigarette, but should have a seed in it. I've also got an update on whether I'm going to be debating Lawrence Fox in the last video that he said he was keen for a debate. So let's see whether he really has the cojones. Well, let's have a debate, Lawrence. Oh, my God. Maybe we should pretend just you and me and not sleep on. Thirdly, I've also booked the Reclaim Party a table at a world-famous London nightclub on the night of the election because, and this cannot be understated, I'm a really nice guy. And finally, um, one of you bumped into Loza on the street and uh, let's just say he showed his true colours. Didn't you, Loza? I don't think I will because I've got an actual job. But firstly, my policies. What are the things that are on my manifesto? How do I see myself helping London? What are they and where am I going to put them? Well, for the where... I did a quick search and realised that the domain name lawrencefox.org was free and ready, so I bought it. With the domain name, I just now need to figure out what was going to go on said website. And so for the policies, I thought, why don't I just ask you guys? I reckon it's time for a street smart. For my policy points, I thought it'd be good to come and speak to Londoners to find out what they would like from their mayor. So I've come to the most diverse part of London, Clapham Common. <laughs> to find out what people really want. I'm Max Fosh and this is the Mayoral Street Smart. What's your name? Ophelia. Ophelia. Of course, we're in Clapham, it's got to be Ophelia. There's no one I want to hear more from than a man with a takeaway pint. <laughs> You're running for mayor, but you don't have a manifesto. Yeah, that's why I've come out to, to speak to the people of London to find out what you would like to see on your mayor's manifesto. I'd like assemblies for Londoners. You know, I'd like uh... Year six assembly. Like, who, yeah. who sits on the benches though? You don't live in London. No, no, I'm actually visiting friends that are registered to vote in London. Uh, I'm not. I'm not. This is a bit of a pointless interview, but let's keep going, Ollie. I'm joined by me. Hi. Every single cigarette, but should have a seed in it. <laughs> That's a really good idea. You know, like when it rains, the cows sit down. So if you gave each household a cow, without running outside and thinking, is my washing getting wet? Is it spitting? You just look in the garden. What does the cow say? I like to see that the Pret Coffee subscription is free forever. Have you used it before? <laughs> We're in Clapham! What would you like to see happen in this wonderful city of ours? Legalised weed. Cow for each household. Can't be that expensive, but we'll work out. Weed might be, ma might be informing that decision on you right now, is that fair to say? Yeah. So something maybe uh, bouncy castle related? Just a man who's baked off his base having some mango in Clapham Common. What a life! Some good policies there. Not bad. You can find all of the policy and the information about the campaign on my new campaign website, www.lawrencefox.org. Sorry, Lawrence, you really should have bought it. Speaking of Lawrence, update time. So in the last video, Lawrence and I had a quick chin wag on the phone, and he agreed to get involved with the debates with me. Well, let's have a debate, Lawrence. So that was a week ago now, and he um, he seems to have, how do I put this kindly, decided not to do that. I've emailed him, his team, his PR guy, marketing guy, Matthew, the guy in the video. None of them have replied to me, totally blanked me, which is very kind of them, really nice. Now, I find this to be quite hypocritical from Lawrence, because he's been banging on and talking about how Sadiq Khan, the Labour candidate, has said that he's not going to debate Lawrence, which Lawrence has got very upset about, because he sees himself as a very important boy. Now, Surely, Lawrence, if you're getting upset that Sadiq won't debate you, then surely you should be debating me, big boy. Hey? Obviously, I'm very upset that Lawrence and his team aren't going to respond, but what I'm going to do instead, instead of getting angry upset, I'm going to kill him with kindness. I'm going to book them a table at one of London's hottest nightclubs, and the table is going to be booked for the night of the election, the 6th of May. Now, the place that I'm going to book them a uh, table at, I think they're really going to like. Loza clearly loves freedom. Freedom. Freedom, freedom. And on his website as well, he has the word freedom written down quite a lot. 
So what I'm going to do is I'm going to book a table for him and his team at the world famous gay bar Freedom in Soho, London. I cannot think of a place that Lodger and the team would love more than Freedom. I've been to Freedom. It's an incredible night out. Let's give him a call. Hello? Hi, is that Freedom Soho? It is, yeah. Hi, yeah. Um, are you doing bookings at the moment? Uh, yeah, we are, yeah. Are you quite busy? Okay, so on the 6th of May, I'd love to book a table. What's the most amount of people you can put on a table? Um, so it's six at the moment. Okay. Um, yeah, can I can I book in a table for the 6th of May at about 10 p.m. Um, for Lawrence Fox? Lawrence Fox? Yeah. yeah. Sure. Uh, let me just have a look. Yeah, so six people on the 6th of May at 10 o'clock. Yes, please. Wonderful. Yeah, that's all booked in for you, Lawrence. Uh, thank you so much. Cheers. Bye. Bye. Happy days. Now, finally, with that act of kindness, hopefully we've got Lawrence back on site because one of you met him whilst you were on a night out at the pub the other night. He wasn't too complimentary about the videos. Max Fosh is everywhere, my friend. Where is he? Are you He's everywhere. Are you him again? I'm Max Fosh. <laughs> okay. I'm Max Fosh. Watch his video, 6 p.m. Really, tonight. Where are your glasses? Remarkable face. <laughs> I know. I'm very posh, aren't I? <laughs> Did you get an arrow? An arrow? Sorry, Harrow. 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 School. I didn't go to Harrow School. Tune in 6 p.m. tonight. I don't think I will because I've got an actual job. I've got an actual job. Lawrence, we're doing the same thing. Buddy old pal, come on. I understand also that you're really like trying to go for this I'm a baby thing. Thank you so much. Have a lovely day. Bye, baby. Bye. It's some of your finest work. But uh, yeah, I'm not sure how well it's working. Either way, see you on May the 6th. Remember, guys, this is all fun and games, but make sure that when you do vote on the 6th of May, remember to look at all of the manifestos and all the policy points of all the candidates and choose which candidate you think would be the best mayor of London. So basically not me or Loza. See you next week. Stop with the winking, Max. It doesn't work.